for the Walmart numbers. You're right, there's a lot of uncertainty in the market. We're going to move on to the C-suite sit-down this morning. Speaking of uncertainty, starting a company in a recession, certainly an uphill battle, but our next guest says may be able to offer some advice on that. We're joined uh, by the CEO of Jack B. Louis Duretchen is with us. Now, Jack B. is involved in something, Louis, called mashup uh, technology on the Internet. I mean, tell, first of all, I think it's, it's best to start off with exactly what that is. You're kind of trying to bring things together where a couple of different websites might do two things, and you're bringing it all into one. How does it, how does it work? Give, it a, give us a good example. Uh, sure. Well, a, a mashup is a dynamic web application that brings together data stored in many different applications for better decision making. So a good example is over the last 10, 20, 30 years, many right. applications have been created with a specific purpose. And today, decision makers in, in set different climate situations need to bring that data together to make good decisions. So make them both work together, in um, other words. Yes. Is, there, is, there a good, uh, is there a big kind of a mainstream example of this working right now uh, that people would, have, would, would know or recognize? There, there are many consumer mashups. Now, what we do is in the enterprise. Right. Uh, and, and most of our... What's a, good, what's a consumer mashup? Uh, off the top Zillow, of your head? for example. Zillow oh, okay. brings together real estate information. I see. That uh, is locked in databases uh, in, in many different uh, counties around tax values, right. property values, and they bring them together, put it on a map. In order put it for in one place. And, right. right. Okay. So now what you're doing is different. You're doing it in, the, as you say, the enterprise uh, arena. Yes. What, what are you doing uh, uh, there with Jack B? And, and as I said, it's, a, it's a kind of a tough time to get going, I guess. Oh, it is. It is. But uh, the, the important thing right now is if you can solve a problem and make companies more efficient and more productive, Right, then, then people continue to buy your software. That's basically what we do. So think about a good example is data stored in a customer relationship management application, then an accounting uh, application, and then maybe in a production application. Right. Bringing those together to get a 360 degree view along with news about your customer that's coming in from Fox News or anywhere yeah. in order to, to be able to make a clear and uh, precise decision at any moment. They can, so they, now they have that all in front of them in one place. That's interesting. Hence now, the word mashup. What you've done, you're kind of a, yeah, mash up. So you're kind of a serial startup guy, right, an entrepreneur. You've done a lot of these types of companies. How in this environment uh, are you able to get funded? You do have funding. We do. Uh, How'd we, you do it? Well, it's, uh, a, a lot of people see the end result and say, you know, how did he do it in this environment? The reality is the company's been around for six years. Yeah, so you didn't have to do it in this environment. Well, th there's a lot of work that comes before that, right? Yeah, you need to figure out a market need. You need to create the technology that satisfies the need. You need to get customers. You need to do everything before that. And ultimately, if you do all everything that's right, the funding is just a natural progression. So you got, but aren't you concerned that the environment that we are in now, in terms of the tight credit and the rough economy, might make all of that? Now that you've gotten to this point, where do you go next? I mean, it, it, it's it's very difficult. Is there is there is there concern that you might not make the next step? Uh, everyone's concerned. Yeah. Right. I mean, from from very large corporations to small co corporations. Uh, but the, the only thing you can do is focus on what you do well, and what you do well is solve problems. And if you solve problems and you're able to keep abreast of what's going on in the environment, then ultimately good things will happen to you. Yeah. All right. Louis, good to meet you, and Thank thanks you. for coming in. Uh, Jack B is the name of the company. Jack B. Louis Directions, the CEO in our C-suite sit-down. We appreciate that.